So we're going to try installing this program called NetLogger. KE1ULN recommended it. Uh, this is Jeff W6FCC. So I downloaded it into a directory over here called NetLogger. I also always grab the uh, URL if it's possible so you can go back to the uh, location where the software can be grabbed. So let's just try uh, installing this. So I'm going to go ahead and, and install it and let's see what happens here. Uh, see what it says. Welcome to NetLogger Setup. Accept the license agreement. Okay. Uh, we'll go ahead and put it in the default directory. Uh, click OK to begin installation. And uh, now it's uh, installing. So I'll assume this takes a minute and we'll pause. Oh, there we go. No, it's not uh, taking long at all. Okay, completed. Now click finish button and uh, I guess we have NetLogger installed. Let me go over here to the start menu and I'll grab this NetLogger program and grab a uh, get the uh, shortcut to it stick it in the same directory. So now I have a shortcut. Let's see uh, how it works. So we run it up and uh, there we go a new beta version is now available. Download the new version. We'll come back to that. Alright, so uh, call sign, I guess I'll put in my own and put in here Jeff and say done. And now we have a NetLogger mode standalone operator net and this appears to be a nice little program. I don't know what it's going to do yet clubs and station locations, accounts. So, but that's all there's involved in, in installing it. And uh, go from there. So give it a try. NetLogger 3.15. Uh, let me shut this down. Let's see where it's located. Okay, I'm going to quit. And uh, here's the uh, NetLogger for Windows web page. And when you bring it up, it's uh, here at NetLogger. Let me grab over here a little farther. NetLogger.org slash download dot PHP and uh, you can go ahead and uh, get this stable release and they have a, another one here. And I guess you can donate to it as well. That's it. W6FCC. Hope uh, this is of some value. Have fun.